Jackson Kleinhammer looks like your typical student. When you see him, he blends in. You wouldn't know it, but every day he goes home, unpacks his school bag, and says hello to his caregivers, grandpa and grandma. Before he came to MC Squared STEM High School, he was living in Akron in a house close to foreclosure. The heat would come on and off. The lights would work only when the bills were paid. Times were tough for Jackson. And that's when grandpa intervened. I am very thankful for my two grandparents. They're the most generous people I've met in my entire life. And they took in my little sister, me, my older sister, and my older brother all at once. And without them, I don't know where our lives would be. And we wouldn't be able to thank them enough for what they've done for us. That's where we came in. MC Squared STEM High School was the school Jackson needed. MC Squared STEM High School offered Jackson the opportunity to live up to his potential, stand out for his accomplishments and not his background, and experience every learning opportunity available to him. When we were looking for high schools in the Cleveland area, my grandparents picked MC Squared STEM, and that wasn't my choice at all, that was all of them. And uh, when I got to the school, I definitely felt a little socially awkward, and that kind of led me into my studies, and I worked hard, and then the teachers began to challenge me once they noticed that. And, Eventually through you know the teachers challenging me and bringing up all these opportunities and things that they think I should try and working with the uh, equipment in the fab lab and doing robotics and stuff like that I, I started to you know get out of that socially awkward phase and you know still work on my studies but not be that kid that sits in the corner. It wasn't just academics either. Jackson got involved. Jackson led the MC Squared STEM high school robotics team through competition building and programming and staying long hours after the building had closed. He became a fabricator, using the Fab Lab to think up and then build designs and inventions that he created himself. I really loved being on the robotics team and working alongside people from my school and we learned how to work together as a team, problem solve and fabricate a robot with all these new technologies none of us had seen before and eventually we got to take our robot to a regional competition and we might not have won that competition, but we definitely learned a lot of invaluable skills along the way. MC Squared STEM High School is leaps and bounds away from the public school he would have attended anywhere else. And while Jackson is happy to blend in with his peers, he is also happy to stand out as a maniac. He has two years left with us, and he looks forward to experiencing all our school has to offer. I'm a junior here at MC Squared STEM High School, and I have two years left, and my time could not have been more well spent. Here at MC Squared STEM High School, they put emphasis on fields like engineering and robotics and science, and that's what really makes the school stand out. And I love being able to tell people things like, oh, in my 10th grade year, I went to GE Neela Park for school, or that I've made a few visits to the NASA Glenn Research Center. And it's just awesome being able to see the look on their face when you explain your school and how different it is from other schools. After high school, I plan on going to the United States Military Academy, or West Point, to pursue my education in robotics. And it's all thanks the MC Squared STEM High School.